What is going on everybody? Welcome back to Phones and Drones. So continuing on with our Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra coverage that we talked about, if you follow the channel, we gave you a little sneak peek that this was coming soon. And today I want to go ahead and show you some of those official cases for the S24 Ultra that Samsung has released, uh, starting right here, as you can see with that silicone shield case. We also have here, probably one of my favorites, the standing grip case. I really like the way this is implemented. I'm very excited to see how it actually plays out on the phone. I have a feeling this will be the one that I will be using personally. And then lastly, we obviously have a typical silicone case. Nothing special here, just in that whitish color pattern to show you exactly how it will look on the device if you're looking to use one of Samsung's own first party accessories. Now, Stay tuned for the channel, thumbs up this video if you want more coverage on official and unofficial third-party accessories, and we will make sure to do a video for you guys on that. Really quick, another little spoiler alert, a soon-to-be-released video will be the S24 Ultra fast charging and the best accessories for that. Actually, that might drop before this one, we'll see. Stay tuned for the channel, thumbs up this video, and let's get right into that case video. So here we go. Here is our assortment of those cases we just talked about in that opening. And let's go ahead and start right to left and take a quick look at the shield case. So as you can see here, again, these are all official first party cases from Samsung. And I think they all are going to be useful for the right person. Let's go ahead and open this up and take a quick look at this one. Uh, again, not my personal favorite necessarily, but for a person that is on the job that might need that extra little bit of protection uh, out in the elements or something like that, this could definitely be a good option. So first things first, as you can see, it is a harder shell construction. It is still flexible though, and it does have a nice looking design here. It is still silicone uh, on the back, so it does feel good nonetheless. You can see the little lifted areas of protection around the corners and obviously the cutouts for all of the ports. So throwing it right on, easy enough. It almost makes the boxy phone a little boxier if that's possible. At least that's kind of what I see on it. Um, but there you go. This is a somewhat off-white color. I think it looks really good. Unfortunately though, as you can see here, it does color up the cover up the color of your device. So if you're looking to show off that color you got, especially in this year's models where they're actually dull but still vibrant in some regards. This probably isn't going to be the best option for you, and really none of these technically will be. You'll want a clear case, but lucky for you, that is offered as well. So again, not bad. It doesn't add a ton of girth to the device, so if you're looking for something a little more rugged, this might be a good option for you. Set that one to the side. Next is your very typical silicone case that we've talked about before. Samsung has offered this specific one for years, kind of like their staple item for a simple case, just like Apple does. And uh, I've had some great experiences with the silicone cases. Very plain, very basic, but it does get the job done every time. And as you can see here, this is more of a white color pattern. Again, all these do come in separate colors. So if you want something different, you can get it, but trying to let the light hit it so you can see how this one looks. See, it almost looks like a harder plastic shell on the inside as well. It looks like it's made out of some recycled materials. It does say validated silicone case, yada yada. Let's go ahead and pop this baby into it as well. And there you go. Somewhat of a basic case looking. Buttons are still very clickable, as you can hear. Always good to see. But again, more of a basic case here, not too much to it. Kind of, really honestly, it's kind of dull personally, but again, a ton of different color patterns if you want to use those as well. Just to show you the difference, since it kind of looks very comparable here, the silicone case and that other one we just did as well, you can see how much darker this one is. Kind of, again, that off-white, almost gray looking case color. But again, they do come in other options if you would like. And like I said, probably the one I've been most looking forward to is this standing grip case. Again, comes in different colors. This is that sky blue or light blue color pattern with that orange accent, which again, kind of like purposely just because it fits the color of the phone. But again, you won't see the actual device color here. Just keep that in mind. Let's go ahead and open this one up and take a quick look.
All right. Okay. I definitely can get behind this color. These are all very muted. Just, just to give you guys a quick look, because it's kind of funny. Very comparable color patterns here. Um, I do like the bluish a little better. Even this gray is not bad. The white is definitely not my favorite. I can see this getting dirtier very easily, but yeah, I'm not here nor there. As you can see here, it says push down the strap until it is secured. Let's pull that off. And it says push it down. And you can see why it says wait till it's secured because if it doesn't click in, it just kind of goes back up. You can hear the click in. There you go. So the whole point of this case is to be able to have like a loop behind the phone so you can actually use it one-handed or to obviously set down like that and watch a video. Let's go ahead and pop this baby on. And again, there you go. So for no extra thickness being added and to be able to just slide this and again, lock it into place, I like this capability and flexibility here on a case. Um, you don't have to worry about it kind of flying off. You can see it's built pretty well, I'm shaking it pretty good and it's not going anywhere. Again, it's meant to be able to put on a stand and you can watch a video if you need, if you're out and don't have another free stand or anything to lean it up against. So I think the utilitarian aspect of it is very nice here. Again, buttons are very tactile and work very well. So quick view of these three official cases. I will be probably keeping this one on the phone just because I did like it the best, like I said, from when I ordered it till now, that hasn't changed. If there's any other specific cases you want, comment down below, let us know. We will be doing a full run through of those. For those of you that follow the channel know we do love Peak Design cases. They will be coming out with one as well, I hope, for the S24 series. So we probably will be getting those to review in the near future also. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you in the next one. Peace.